Five good years in steering Africa region to greater success. The 43rd session of Codex Alimentarius Commission is the first ever virtual commission session to be held due to COVID-19 pandemic and will witness the transition in regional coordinating committee leadership. CC Africa celebrates achievements we have made so far and look forward to strengthening our cooperation as a region. As a coordinator, Kenya has worked hard on various fronts to ensure that food safety is a priority in the region and in the global agenda. Some of the key achievements include one, improved coordination on codex issues in Africa, an African group with a stronger voice on codex issues. Two, our bilateral relationship with other codex regions is at all time high. Three, adoption at the commission of three regional standards, Shia Pata, Fermented Cook Cassava, and Nitam Species Leaves. Four, adoption of the proposed draft regional standard on dried meat at step five, and new work on proposed guidelines on support, to support development of harmonized food laws in the Africa region. Africa has hosted the first uh, FAO WHO African Union International Food Safety Conference. Six, during our coordination, 18 Africa countries benefited from the Codex Trust Fund. Codex Trust Fund is an efficient tool to assist countries in building their capacities to advance food safety agenda in the region. Seven, Africa has celebrated World Food Safety Day since it was adopted by the UN National General Assembly. We are delighted with the great efforts of many countries to raise awareness and profile of food safety on the observance of World Food Safety Day. As Kenya exits the stage, I wish to encourage Africa to focus, among others, on development of food standards for the Africa region, with particular emphasis on food safety and quality in order to protect consumer health and fair practices in food trade. This calls for strengthening regulatory, scientific, and technological capacities at all levels across the food chain and for a shift towards more sustainable patterns of food production and consumption. Codex standards are necessary to underpin these efforts. Viva Africa! I am Sunil Bakshi from India. India has been the coordinator for CC Asia since 2015. As coordinator for CC Asia, the region is proud of developing a practical framework of coordination among member countries of the region in the form of a standard operating procedure, which could also be utilized as a model document by the Codex as a whole. Participation of all the countries from the region in the Codex-related work has been a challenge on account of various reasons. To overcome this difficulty, a mechanism of co-chairing of RCC meetings by least developed countries in the region was conceived. However, the same could not be put into practice and needs to be pursued further. To our successor coordinator China, we may say that the strength of the coordinator is reflective of the strength of the member countries of the region. Therefore, for further strengthening of the region, a sharp focus needs to be on the member countries that require technical assistance and capacity building. Thank you. My name is Naila Karsebekova. Kazakhstan has been the coordinator for CC Euro since 2017. As coordinator, we are most proud of revitalization of the post-Soviet countries and the work of Codex. There were also challenges such as different levels of involving countries in work of Codex, which is currently on the way of optimization, and secondly, the challenge to humanity, the COVID-19 pandemic, which triggered the digital tools of work and closer cooperation in a new virtual environment. My name is Diego Varela. I am from Chile. My country has hosted the Coordinating Committee for Latin America and the Caribbean since 2015. 
As a coordinator, I would say that we are most proud of the South-South cooperation environment we have fostered. Uh, this region has tremendous knowledge and we have witnessed the benefits of sharing that knowledge between us to strengthen our participation and involvement in Codex. We still have challenges such as the need to enhance our participation in the scientific auxiliary bodies of the Commission, but we have worked to overcome this by hosting different activities like the recent workshop to better understand the functioning of the JMPR that took place in Chile last February. To our successor, Ecuador, our very best wishes for the journey you are about to start. You can count with the support from Chile and, I dare to say, from all the countries in the region. We will always be there to work with you and, 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 and to help you lead the way to take us further in Codex. Thank you. Greetings fellow Codex members and non-government organizations. I want to congratulate the Codex and its parent organization, the Food and Agriculture Organization and the World Health Organization to adopt your work programs so that you can still continue this work of Codex amidst this global pandemic. Hosting the meeting of the 43rd session of the Codex Alimentarius Commission is testament to that progression and work adaptation. Vanuatu wishes to express its gratitude to members of the CC and ASWP region and the wider Codex community for your support during our tenure as regional coordinator of our region. Vanuatu is proud that during our tenure as a region, we managed to get our first regional food safety standard endorsed by the Commission. The original standard for cover products for use as a beverage when mixed with water holds a lot of hope for us to trade cover products within our region and beyond. We congratulate Fiji, who will be our next regional coordinator, and Vanuatu reaffirms its commitment to the work of Codex and food safety in our country, in our region, and our global community. I thank you all. My name is Mohammad Hossein Shojai and Iran has been the coordinator for CC Near East since 2015. As coordinator, we are most proud of a spirit of solidarity among members. There are also challenges such as lack of adequate infrastructure for risk assessment, but it could be resolved by establishing pool experts and sharing information. I wish our successor, Saudi Arabia, all the best. 